It's Trisha Mandis, and you are watching Take Control Tuesdays, where you learn how to take control of your diet, your weight, and your health. You would never believe who I got a letter from today. I could not believe my eyes. It was from Santa Claus. It was from Mr. Chris Kringle himself, and he has a Take Control Tuesday question for me today. Dear Trisha, I am concerned. As you know, I have so many Christmas duties to take care of, but I'm starting to get worried. I just heard on the radio a new study found dairy products are associated with prostate cancer. Milk of all foods, I tell you what, now what am I supposed to do? Trisha, as you know, one of my favorite parts of Christmas is drinking milk under the Christmas tree from all over the world. I really don't know if this dairy and prostate cancer study is true. What's the deal, Trish? Do I really have to stop drinking milk? Thanks for all your help, Trisha. You've been a good girl this year, and I love your Take Control Tuesday videos. Love, Santa Claus. P.S. Can you please put vegan plant-based cookies under the tree this year? Mrs. Claus is on my butt to lose some weight. Well, Santa, I have to tell you that that study was correct. You're referring to a study that was published in November 2014 in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition. And the researchers found that cheese consumption, low-fat milk consumption, all milk consumption, and total dairy consumption were all associated with an increased risk of prostate cancer. Now, this wasn't just one study either. These researchers conducted a meta-analysis and they took 32 different prospective studies following milk drinkers and prostate cancer and they combined all of these studies together and got these results, which actually makes them even more significant and stronger. The researchers also found that supplemental calcium was associated with an increased risk of fatal prostate cancer, so you should know that as well. However, interestingly enough, that's so hard to say, interestingly though enough, <laughs> interestingly though, interestingly though, non-dairy sources of calcium were not associated with an increased risk of prostate cancer. Yay for plants! So this is garbanzo beans, broccoli, raw carrots, tofu, and almond milk, which actually has more calcium in it than milk. So Santa, my advice to you is to ask your beloved milk drinkers and milk servers to stop putting that cow udder lactation fluid under the tree and instead put a glass of almond milk. And because you are concerned about your belly and you want some vegan healthy plant-based cookies under the tree, I am going to share three plant-based vegan healthy cookie recipes on my website. So make sure you go to trishamandis.com and get those there. Now Santa and I would love to hear from you. Please answer today's Take Control Now question and put your comments in the comments section below this video. Do you have concerns about drinking milk or not drinking milk? Please share your thoughts below. And if you like this video, which I really hope that you did, please click the like button, share it with your friends, or better yet, come to trishamandis.com and when you sign up for free weekly email updates where you get special information I only share in email, then you get a free weight loss resource guide sent directly to your inbox with the best resources, books, movies, recipe websites for achieving optimal health and permanent weight loss. Thank you so much for watching today's episode. Get educated, get support, and take control. You can get the healthy body you deserve.